In this video, I will show you how to create a snow falling effect using CSS. To start, let's create a dev with a class of snow wrapper. This will hold the dev with a class of snow as our snow particles. For our CSS, let's make the background darker. Set the position to absolute. Top and left properties to zero. Add a width and height of 100%. Set the pointer events to none. Set the z-index property to a higher value so this is stacked above other elements. For the snow dev elements, set the width and height to 10 pixels. This will be our default styling. Add a background of white. Set the border radius to 50% to make it a circle. Let's add an animation property. It's not working yet, so let's create the animation keyframe falling snow. In this keyframe animation, the styles of the element are animated from the initial state, 0%, to the final state, 100%. In the initial state, 0%, the element is translated vertically by 0 pixels. In the final state, 100%, the element is translated vertically by 100% of the viewport height. Now, to continue the default animation property value, add the duration of the animation to 3 seconds. The timing function of the animation is linear, which means that the animation progresses evenly across the duration. The iteration count of the animation is infinite, which means that the animation repeats indefinitely. Let's set the position absolute to the snow dev elements. Set the left property to zero. And the top to negative 40 pixels. I added the negative 40 pixels since the bigger snow element we will create is about 40 pixels, and we don't want it to show at the top in the initial animation run. Next, let's override the CSS for the other snow elements. Change the left property values. Also, update the width and height. As well as the animation delay.
Thank you for watching our video. I hope you enjoyed it and learned something new. If you liked my content, please give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. I will continue to create more videos that are informative and entertaining, so stay tuned for more. Thank you again for watching, and Merry Christmas!